J Drone here. It is the Wingsland Mini Vets camera, and uh, I just kind of wanted to give you a look at it. If you are heavy pitching forward, you're going to see the propellers, as you can see right now. I'm pitching as forward as I can go. And if you do a very, very hard bank turn, which I did not leave in the video because I wanted smooth transitions here, the gimbal kind of drops down and then picks back up. So be aware of that. Uh, I will have a full flight with this video in it. That way you can see exactly what I'm talking about. But all in all, I think this drone was meant for, uh, I think this was meant for video. I mean, set up for video, not really sport flying, kind of just a cruise. Here's a, here's a up high look. We're going to climb altitude. We're actually going to hit right over a hundred meters here. And that's when the FPV screen that came stock with this went out and I no longer had transmission. But as far as the gimbal goes, minus the hard banking, it works well. And as far as the drone flies, the GPS is extremely strong on this. Even when you take it out of GPS and it's on manual, there's still GPS hold on it where it's dragging just a little bit. Good thing, bad thing, that's debatable. I mean, uh, if you're going to use this for all intents and purposes, what I think it was made for, a video drone, then it's really not a bad thing because it's going to hold you where you're supposed to be and it's going to give you the assist that you need. Myself, I'm used to flying brushless drones with no features or like the Alcenma where you can turn all the features off and kind of make it a sport flyer. This is not the, in that category. This is almost strictly a camera drone. It does have a little bit of speed to it. Um, as far as the range, I've gotten right over 300 feet with it. I really haven't push pushed it too much yet just because I have friends that say this drone is a possible flyaway drone. So did I want to lose it the first time flying it? Absolutely not. But, but did I want to baby fly it? Again, absolutely not. So that's why we took it up about 100 meters, 100 meters in change and 100 meters out in change just to make sure that this can fly. Are we going to push the limits a little bit more as I get more comfortable with this drone? Absolutely. Um, and again, I'm going to load a full flight review, go over setup, go over calibration, go over uh, button configuration because this does have like almost four sets of toggles on it. And uh, you're definitely going to want to know what they do and what the functions are but all in all the looks of this drone is ridiculous through the roof straight dope i love it uh the flyability again gps is super strong on it which i'm not completely with but again as a video drone it's excellent to have with a video drone and as far as video quality and the gimbal goes i'm giving it like a nine and a half out of ten now we're chalking it a 0.5 just because of the hard banking when it drops down guys i'm j drone if you have not subscribed please do um if you're on facebook check out drone days it is a dope dope group link will be at the bottom and uh, again always fly safe know where you're flying know where your air traffic is and uh do a pre-flight before you fly 